And the UI's trade union center held a strike and mobilization against the retirement and the pension reform bill. Our correspondent, Mateo Grille, has more. For the second time in two months, the Uruguay and Trade Union Center held a partial general strike, this time under the slogan against the inequality model. The strike included a mobilization to the legislative palace. We are clearly facing a government that only thinks of those who have money, of businessmen, and of those who in some way are starving an entire country today. There is more hunger, more people eating in soup kitchens, and yet the government's approach is contentious and criminalizes solidarity and even poverty. We are really facing a lack of empathy with the people of a government that really attacks a part of the country. Workers from different unions walked several blocks with different demands, highlighting the rejection of a pension reform proposed by the government of La Calle Pau. Today is not just another day, not just another strike. Today we, the organized workers, are here, but also throughout the country to stand up to the brutal reform that they want to impose on us. We are here to say no to the pension reform. According to the workers, the reform proposed by the government and currently under preliminary consideration only benefits private pension funds administrators whose sole objective is to profit. This reform only benefits the folks taking care of the hands and referring to the financial capital in its AFAP form, which is the only one benefited by this reform project and that we, from the organized labor movement, reject our right. Because social security is a fear of social protection. It is a fear of conquest, of benefit. It is not a fear of profit. According to the government, the bill seeks to ensure the future sustainability of a pension system, but to do so, it implements an old recipe. It increases the retirement age and reduces pensions and retirement, given this scenario. Don't let them steal our future. Long live the working class. Long live the trade union center. And long live those who never surrender. It is likely that the conflict will continue and that this will not be the last mobilization on this issue. Mateo Montevideo, Uruguay.